y'all, it's Dan, back with another manga review. I, I have to first off state that I'm not your average manga reader. I don't typically read manga. So if you came here looking for manga reviews, you might want to seek another channel because it's not really my type of thing. Um, I do happen to read horror mangas now and again. But enough of that, let's get on with the review. Um, this time I'm here to review Venus in the Blind Spot by Junji Ito. Um, this is supposed to be a quote-unquote best of, but there was only one story in here which I had already read from his other collections. So I don't know why it's considered a best of because it contained a lot of stories I'd never seen before. Um, of course... You know, there was a story that's that's after the self-title. That one was it was it was okay. Um, there was a weird story about people being alone and then finally getting together and ending up being stitched together. Like I, there, a life. To be honest with you, I felt like a lot of these stories were just weird, just weird. And I get it. it you know, Japanese culture is a totally different culture, so they think. Things are terrifying to them, or just kind of weird for us, I guess you could say. Um, there was another story up called The Licking Woman, and this lady would go around licking people, and she had this huge, gross tongue. I thought that one was really strange. Um, there was one called The Human Chair. Um, that one was kind of creepy, because it was like about a stalker who hid himself away in a chair, and... There was um, another one about a baby who was born from a dead mother. It was just... Yeah, um, guys, I thought this was just okay. Just because it was so weird and I couldn't relate to a lot of it. Um, I decided to give this a 3 out of 5 star rating. Like I said, it's it's just not my thing. I mean, you may see. There's the gross tongue thing. You may you may love you may love this. I thought it was okay. It was just not my thing. Um, I did think some of the stories were good and interesting, and then the rest I thought were just too strange and weird for me. So I did give this a three out of five star rating on Goodreads. It is what it is. Like I said, that's why I told you guys up front. I'm not a manga fan. I'm not a manga fan at all. I'm just, it's not my thing. I don't seek this stuff out, typically. Um, I do like to read horror mangas every now and then. Like, I got another one that's about zombies, which I'm going to read later in the month. But, um, of course, as always, for you folks in the U.S., I will have a link to Amazon down below, and I'm going to try to find it at bookshop.org for you international peeps. Um, if you got something from watching this video, by all means, buy me a coffee or two down below. I will have a link to that. If you came here looking for other comics, reviews, and recommendations, please hit that subscription button. While you're there, hit that notification bell. This has been Dan. This has been Venus in the Blind Spot. Till next time, stay healthy and be good to each other.